Hi Aries, this is Petra at IndigoTarot.club and I'm here to do a general reading for you for May 2017. I've already shuffled and cut the cards from four decks and I'm going to do a reading for work, home, love, money, and overall advice for you. So let's get started. For work, Aries, I have the Queen of Pentacles, the Four of Pentacles, and the Knight of Cups. And it feels like your boss is a woman. She's aggravating you in May. You would rather have a different job, but you really need the money right now, so you're sticking with this job through May. But you really, really, really want an offer from elsewhere. And it looks like if you do put in your resume at different places in May, you're going to get at least one offer that's going to make you very, very happy. And it could be around the 22nd of May. So I strongly suggest if you're not happy at your job, you start looking for another job and putting out your resume because it looks like you're going to get an offer. For some of you, you're going to get an offer of a date from someone that you work with. And it looks like you're going to take that person up on the offer and you're going to go out to breakfast or lunch over the weekend away from work. The job that you have, it feels like it's a Monday through Friday office job, big, big office um, and this person is going to ask you out for coffee or breakfast or lunch or brunch. And um, you're going to take this person up on this, uh, on this offer. Okay, for home, for you, Aries, for May 2017, I have the Nine of Cups, the Seven of Pentacles, and the Five of Swords. Something at home is going to make you very happy. Um, for some of you, you're going to invite some people over for some kind of party or gathering at your house. And you're going to have a really good time serving people, baking for them, cooking for them. And they're going to love your food and you're going to get tons of compliments. And hopefully you're open to receiving those compliments without feeling like, like they're just telling you that just to make you feel better. You really are a very good cook and baker and they're going to be very impressed. For others of you, you're doing some work in your garden a vegetable garden and some of you flower garden but for the vegetable garden I'm seeing that you're very very you're looking forward to you're looking forward to the harvest of your vegetable garden and then for others of you um, I'm getting a separate message here it feels like somebody at your house it could be a teenager it could be um, a friend of your teenage son or daughter that may be hiding something from you or doesn't want you to know about something it could involve cigarettes maybe they're getting trying to get your teen to smoke cigarettes or something yeah one of your one of your children is in the teenage stage or puberty stage and a friend of theirs that visits your house quite regularly is doesn't want you to know that they're trying to get your teenager to smoke so you need to keep your eyes peeled for that Okay, for love, I have the Hermit, the Ace of Cups, and the Three of Pentacles. If you know a Virgo, you may be interested in a Virgo or, or uh, dating a Virgo, and it looks like um, you're going to have very happy, great, loving time with this person in May. Um, they admire you very much and for others of you you think this person is super super handsome or beautiful and they're also artistic and creative and you love their work that they put out as well for others of you um, you're being asked to do more to do some research on the person that you're uh, dating make sure that they are single make sure that they are not seeing other people if you want a relationship that involves just uh, you and that person uh, you're being advised to ask questions and uh, see if you could tell if that person is telling you the truth or not when you ask these questions. See how serious they are about you or see if they're seeing other people. Um, this is for those of you that when you're dating someone, you don't, you don't date other people. You just date that person and you want them to just to date you during that time, during that phase that y'all are getting to know each other. For others of you, like I said, um, if you know a Virgo or maybe it's some, some other earth sign, so Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, or a practical person or uh, entrepreneur or someone who's very laid back and down to earth, you're going to start dating them in May. You really like the way they look or and or you really like their work. 
their output, their artistry. Okay, Aries for money. I have the Queen of Cups, the Ace of Wands, and the Five of Pentacles. Some of you are being asked to sign a contract and hastily, and it's not a good idea to do that. Some of you should not sign that contract. Some of you need to get some uh, an attorney or someone to look over this contract and help you decipher it. Others of you are musicians. I'm being drawn to the contract again. So others of you are musicians and you also have to deal with a contract in May and you're being asked to read the fine print. Don't just sign haphazardly. Uh, read the fine print. Get some other people to help you look over this contract. Okay. A few of you are going to be spending some money on a vacation. It could have to, it could be a cruise um, that you're going on and it's just showing me that you're happy and you're having a good time and you might it might be you and two or three other women going together on this cruise. So that's good. Okay, so for overall advice for you Aries for May 2017, I pulled teacher. So let me read that. This is the um, Ascended Masters Oracle cards from Doreen Virtue. So let me read that to you. This card is about learning and teaching. You've learned a lot from your experiences and relationships, and now it's time to pass that knowledge along to others. Your current situation is bringing you opportunities for spiritual growth and teaching you some important life lessons. As soon as you understand and accept these lessons, old patterns will drop away and be replaced by wonderful new experiences. Additional meanings for this card. This person or situation is bringing you important life lessons. Ask yourself, what's the blessing that this situation has brought to me? Your life purpose involves teaching. Forgive a teacher from your past. You are urged to teach others. So those are the additional meanings. So Aries, I hope you enjoyed this reading for May 2017. I look forward to seeing you in June. If you'd like to enter for a chance to win a free reading from me, you can visit indigotarot.club to register. And on my Indigo Tarot YouTube channel, I also have another giveaway for a three-pack gift for Mother's Day. So you might want to check that out as well. Good luck to you. Thank you for watching and listening. This is Petra from indigotarot.club.